Good morning. It's a beautiful morning in the city of Jerusalem, and it's currently 5:58 a.m. I am going to take you with me today and show you how my day goes as a Tanzanian citizen. So just got off bed, organized some stuff, did this, did that, and what falls next is obviously I take a shower, brush my teeth, eat, and then I take an advantage of the time I have before leaving home. I go through my stuff like I study. We're gonna study for the math test. Okay, now it's time to go to school. It's 8.23 and I got my cup of coffee and a few other things in my bag. Let me show you what I have in my bag. Okay, here are the things that are in my bag. I have a bottle of water, I have a pencil case, a little snack for the day and two books which is maths and economics and my tablet. I'm going to have only two subjects today because it's Friday. So let's go. Before leaving the house, I just wanted to show you guys my outfit for the day. Um, I wore a black vest and these baggy pants. I don't know the yoga. They're called yoga pants. I don't know how to call them. Local market in Dar es Salaam. Together with this little bowl. It's a bowl made up of a material called kitenge. It's a famous material throughout Africa going to wear my Maasai shoes. I just wanted to show you. I love them so much. They're really comfortable and they have all these pretty beads. Oh, I think I... Uh, <laughs> it's not like a bit of a okay, bro. Ah, bro, you know, we lost it. I don't even tell. I'm explaining the suka creation is inside. Yes, why not? <sighs> that's, that's the beauty. It's good if you know what is inside. Could there be a way in economic so can... <laughs> 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 I got you! Hello, so I just got back home. That was my day. Nothing interesting, honestly. I just studied the whole day, at least when it's a weekday. I'll try making another video of how my day goes on a Saturday, which is going to be tomorrow, because today is actually a Friday. Usually, my Fridays are a bit more interesting, because we get to do extra activities on Friday. Nothing big. We basically just go swim, or we go play football. We were supposed to go play football today, but then it was raining. We were a bit overloaded with the work, so... It's 4.18. Sometimes I come home. This is the earliest time I get to come back home. Sometimes I come back home at at 6, sometimes at 7. It has been three months that I've been going to that school. And we finished the whole Form 5 syllabus within two months. And now we're doing our Form 6. And I'm having my Form 5 exams in May, June. The rest of my evening is basically basic. I just sit home and I wait for mom to come back. We make dinner, we eat, we watch TV. Honestly, my days throughout Monday to Friday is just like studying, 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 studying. Lucky. Just stop. Meet my cat. His name is Lucky. He has been with us for more than three years now and he's like a member of our family. So you see the weirdest thing about this guy is that whenever somebody comes over to a place like my friends who live here, they come here and they're usually like, oh you got your cat all the way from Russia. I'm just like, no we didn't. It's like we got him here and nobody actually believes this. People think that he's just like um, a European breed or something. Actually, at my place where I study, Robert's place, he the way they have he has cats and kittens, so they're really really tiny. They're just like like that tiny, but our cat is big and not tiny. <laughs> Good morning. It's currently 8:28 a.m. I just woke up. I woke up a bit late. I am going to take you with me and show you how my Saturday goes. But first, we have to get ready for the day. Okay, currently we're watching some cartoons and then after that we're gonna have a little activity where we're going to draw characters from the cartoon and discuss every single character and talk about the thing that was in the cartoon.
Okay, I'm sorry. I just realized that I didn't give enough explanations about the Russian Culture Center. So, Russian Culture Center Saturday School works every single Saturday and it is composed of three main classes. Wait, sorry, four main classes. The first one, which are like the youngest kids, the one that I am usually in, it's like kids from three, five years old, or like um, three, the young. <laughs> Okay, we did not find anything interesting, but we keep on roaming around the city and see what we can find. Bye. Do you see that man? He's actually selling secondhand clothes. So he just walks around the street, comes across somebody, and like when they want the, the clothes, he just sells them to them. This man can literally walk around the whole day looking for customers. And we arrived to a second stop, which is here. <laughs> we arrived to Mlimani City, which is the biggest mall in Dar es Salaam. It has a variety of different, different stores, different cafes, different restaurants right now. Where are we? Where are we? Mlimani City. What is Mlimani City? It's a place you could do anywhere. It's a place you could do anything, basically, from eating to shopping to window shopping to having fun. of the prices for five thousand that's around two thousand dollars a big burger for eight thousand but yeah, it's right across another fast food um, cafeteria called Mary Brown that's the place where I ate, we ate today to enter inside this shop called Splash that's where I Somebody's having a dance party. These are the cinemas. We have Ghostbusters, we have the Turtles. Uh, the prices of watching a movie approximately are, the cheapest are on Thursday. There are 5,000. And uh, 5,000 is around $2.5. No, actually around $2, not even $2.5. That's the cheapest day. And then the most expensive day is on the weekends and public holidays where it goes from. 10,000 to 15,000 sign shillings. That's around seven dollars of my day, which is Saturday. But because my phone died, I should always walk around with the charger. Keep on forgetting to walk around with the charger. But yeah, um, the day ended with my friend coming over. Her name is Sharon, and I did her nails. So it was fun. We stayed up until like 1 a.m. because we were taking our time. We had like, we were talking a lot, like literally forgetting about. But yeah, it was fun. It was honestly fun. So I'll show you guys the results of our, like of what we did with the nails. And yeah, that's basically my Saturday. Mm, it's currently 1 a.m. This chick kept me here for mm, a while. Well. I know the best. 